everything that you get after you hit level 100 in Fortnite chapter 2. Drink to a sunny Yo, what's going on guys, Fruity here and welcome back to another video on the channel. So today guys, I'm going to be showing you guys everything that I actually have, seeing as I am now over level 100 in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 3. So we are going to get into it, but before we do, it would honestly mean so much guys if you were to leave a like on this video. If we can get 1,000 likes, that would literally be awesome. Also, make sure you subscribe, we are so close to half a million subscribers, so make sure you subscribe with your notifications on. And also, comment down below what level you guys are in Chapter 2 Season 3, it'd be really interesting to know how much you guys have been playing and also what level you are. So guys, without further ado, I'm going to be showing you guys everything that I've unlocked being over a level. 100 that is going to be all of the styles i've actually unlocked and also all of the stuff that i have access to now that i am over level 100 so guys without further ado let's just get right into this video hopefully you guys do go on to enjoy so let's just get right into the video all right so as you can see right now we are inside of the game we are on the lobby and i'm basically going to be showing you guys everything that you get after you hit level 100 in fortnite chapter 2 season 3 as you guys can see we are over level 100 right now so let me show you guys pretty much everything that you get after getting level 100 but guys make sure you go down there and smash a thumbs up we get a thousand likes that literally be crazy but let's get into it okay so here we go so the first thing you're obviously going to get when you get to level 100 is a fully completed battle pass. That's the most obvious thing. Everyone knows that. So when you get level 100, you will basically have access to everything in the battle pass. That's the most obvious thing that we're going to get out of the way. But let's move on to more of the stuff that you guys may not know that you actually get when you get level 100 or level 100 plus. So let's just get right into those. All right. So starting off, what we actually have is a few styles that you can actually get. Or I think one specific style for one of the tier one skins, I believe is. So let me show you guys that really quickly. So if we go across from Aquaman right now and head over to the fade skin, as you guys can see, one of the styles that you actually can get a level 100 is the fade masks now guys look how insane this skin looks it looks really really nice so as you can see this is literally insane this skin is so nice i love all the purple smoke and i just love how it looks it's really really nice so let's move on to some other stuff that you get level 100 also really quickly while we're talking about styles and stuff like that i might as well show you guys every single style for every skin if you guys haven't already seen so so this season the exclusive skin is aquaman and to actually get him you have to do five of the aquaman challenges which will be coming out weekly if you guys didn't know and then you can also go ahead and get his style as well and you can also unlock the pickaxe which is literally crazy so that is what you can get you can get the Aquaman. obviously you can get all of the fade styles you can get the ocean styles which you don't get from leveling up you get from actually doing weekly challenges and that is the same with this skin that is the same with all of these styles and obviously the same with these ones i think these ones as well yep all of these are weekly challenges so i mean it's a bit different to last season where everything was to do with actually leveling up which i mean if you guys don't remember the grind to get agent peely you had to get like level 300 or something so i mean i guess it's kind of cool that they're making it a little bit easier to get styles but i mean leveling up to like level 200 300 was literally like insane and i'm sure a lot of you guys might miss that but i mean let's move on to some other stuff that we can actually do over level 100 so you may have seen throughout the battle pass that you can actually get build umbrella upgrades so as you guys can see right now if we go across the battle pass there are quite a few different kind of upgrades you can get we got one here at tier 75 which is the bottom cap upgrade so i mean you can get all of these different things and because obviously i am level 100 if i go show you guys what the build umbrella looks like for me as you guys can see these are well i mean this is the umbrella i've created let me know down below in the comments guys what do you think of my umbrella personally i think it looks really really nice so as you guys can see i am basically able to pretty much choose any umbrella I want seeing as I have got all the upgrades so if you guys look right here I have access to all of them and I mean I can finalize it but I'm just gonna wait for a little while because I think to actually change the colors of things you have to wait for the weekly challenges so I'm gonna wait until I can fully make it and then I'll actually finalize it but guys this is the umbrella I've made as I said let me know down below if you guys like it so this is one of the things you can do when you get to tier 100 or level 100 you can actually fully build your own umbrella and then finalize it and use it in game which is really cool so a bit like the Maya skin from the last season but this time it's just with an umbrella so if you guys are wondering how to actually level up really really quick Fortnite have actually introduced a bunch of stuff this season that you can do. Now, there are a few things carried over from last season, but let me show you guys some other stuff which you may have not already seen. All right, so starting off with the obvious one, you're actually able to obviously do the weekly challenges. And doing these, as you guys can see, will get you 35 thousand xp so i mean you can go ahead and do your weekly challenges as you guys know these will come out every single week so a load of xp is going to be made through those and then also a new thing which they put here well i guess it's not really new but it's something that they've kind of changed up for this season now if you go over to this thing and go over to the punch cards if you guys do these you will get xp so if you click more info it actually says track progress and and earn xp experiment on the island to discover punch cards reach milestones in each punch card to earn xp so guys you have to discover the punch cards and then once you complete them you will be getting a bunch of xp so if we go through the ones I've got. I've got quite a few of them done. I mean, I haven't fully completed them, but I've actually got quite a bit of progress done throughout all of these. So guys, that is another thing you can do for obviously leveling up in the new season of Fortnite. So guys, I recommend doing all your punch cards, all your weekly challenges. So yeah, make sure you guys are doing your challenges. And also on screen right now, I'm also going to put up a little bit of a secret that they did add last season for when you got over level 100, I believe, and they've done it again this season. And guys, I'll put it on screen right now. So here we go. As you guys can see right now, they have actually made it so there's animation behind the level 100, just like they did last season. So I mean, who knows if they've changed it for when you get level 200 or something like that. Maybe it does a different animation. 
who knows? But apart from that, guys, let's just go ahead and we're gonna go in a game and we're gonna see if I can level up because I actually have some supercharged XP. So, guys, let's get into a game and let's see if we can get a victory royale. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and land at retail row. And as you can see, we are so close to leveling up and also we have XP supercharge as well. So, guys, we're gonna go ahead and see if we can win this game and see how much XP we can actually get. So, guys, let's go. Okay, so we've already got some shield. We've also got one of the new charged shotguns, which actually I really like the new charged shotguns. I think they're pretty good if you can use them in the right way. So, I mean, I like them. I mean, let me know down below in the comments what you guys think about them. All right, so what we're gonna get in this chest and we've got, yes, an upgrade on our shotgun. And I mean, we've already got maximum minis. So, I mean, we can't carry those. We are actually getting quite good loot. All right, let's see what we get in this chest. Attack. I think I'm gonna stay with the charged shotgun for now, but let's just get some more mats and oh, big ammo box. Come on, give us something good. Okay, yes, a big shield. Uh, I guess we'll carry that over the bandages. There is someone inside of this building and I can just hear them charging up their shotgun. I don't know where, okay, they're right there. All right, let's try and make them shoot their shotgun, maybe? I don't know what to do. All right, let's try and see if we can make them shoot their shotgun. I don't know where they are. All right, he's right here. He is right on us right now. All right, we hit him pretty big. I think that was like 109, maybe? All right, let's see if we can try and get him right now. Yes, let's go. Okay, I knew it. He was so low. We got him really good with the pump there. We charged it up pretty good. And I think he did like 109 or something. Wait, has he got a purple one? I think he has a purple shotgun. That's a purple charged shotgun. Let's go. All right, let's pick it up. We are so close to leveling up. We're literally one bar away. All right, let's get all this loot. And I think there's a chest inside of here as well. Let's try and get that. All right, here we go. Another chest. Anything good? Okay, a med kit. And now I think there was also another chest inside of this building. I don't think any of these have been looted. Let's just go inside here. Any good loot? I think there's a chest over this way. All right, through this door, there should be a chest. So come on. Any good loot in this one? Come on, give us something good. Okay, a green AR. That's actually a bit of an upgrade, but now I think we're just going to head more into the zone. Probably go like lazy or something like that, so let's go. Okay, there we go. We have leveled up to level 122. I just got one of my punch cards done, so there we go. We leveled up. Now, I think there are some people over there, so we got to go and eliminate them. Okay, yeah, there's actually... Wait, someone right here just got sniped. I think we might be able to get an elimination. Oh, wait. There is someone right there. Okay, should we go and try and see if we can eliminate them? Let's charge up the shotgun. No! At least we leveled up, but oh my, that was so intense. A helicopter came and everything, but guys, let's go again and see if we can actually get a win. Oh my goodness. Let's go! We've got the mythic weapons and everything. Let's actually go right now. We got the we got the shotgun and also the grenade launcher. Okay, so I see someone just over there, and then there's also someone inside of this forest area. So we need to keep our eyes peeled, and I think he might be using the launch pad right now. Okay, so the last two people apart from me are inside of a fight right now, and I think we might be able to win if we can get third party on them. Actually, I might just go to zone. Alright, I think I'm just gonna go to zone. So let's just do that. Boom, let's go! All right, here we are. We've made it to zone, and I don't know if those guys have, like, a launch pad or anything to get in, but I think we might actually be good here. Top three. Let's go. We can win this. There's two other people. I don't know where one of them is. One of them's right there, but there's also another one, and I think he's over there as well, but I'm not sure. Yes, let's go. There we go. We got a win right there. That is how we do it with all of the new mythic weapons as well. We got the shotgun and the grenade launcher. There we go. We were able to get the win. So, guys, thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on. And apart from that, have a great rest of your day, everyone, and peace.